when I bought my DX7, it came with a cartridge. Um, and it actually came with um, a RAM cartridge, which was this one, um, which has uh, some D50 sounds on it. Um, so obviously somebody, and as you can see, I've got a D50 sitting below my DX7, so I don't really need D50 sounds because I've got lots of them. Um, so, um, but that allowed me to store sounds back off the DX7. However, what it didn't do was allow me to get back to the original um, DX7 sounds. So I did a little bit of research on online and found out that when uh, the DX7, definitely the 2, I'm not sure about the 1, but definitely the 2, when the 2 was uh, sold to the general public, they always included this. And this is the DX7 2D, 2FD um, restore cartridge. So this cartridge will restore the DX7 back to its factory sounds. And that was included as part of the, uh, in the box, effectively, when you bought your DX7. But it wasn't included when I bought mine. So, again, I went on the internet, uh, eBay. eBay is the place where you pick a lot of this stuff up. You sometimes use Gumtree, but you tend to get a better, better set of results on eBay. Um, and it also means you can talk to uh, colleagues and, and keyboard players across the world. Because this, this stuff goes is universal. Um, so when I did did a little bit of searching around the, the internet, I actually found somebody, um, funny enough, not very many miles away from where I live, um, who was selling the cartridge. Didn't have the keyboard anymore, but had the cartridge. So I bought the cartridge off him for about £30. And it's brilliant, because that means now that I can plug this in to my DX7, like so, and I can go back to the original factory sounds that came off the DX7. So um, I've published videos in the past about reloading from SysX and reloading from cartridge. And it's always quicker to reload from cartridge. Um, you know, it, it literally is seconds. Whereas SysX takes a while, you've got to configure the computer, you've got to download the SysX, etc. So there you go. If you've got a DX7 Mark II, I highly recommend you do a search on the internet and you go and find yourself one of these because it will get you back to the original factory sounds and of course the original factory sounds have got that wonderful Yamaha piano on it. Anyway, there you go.